Hezbollah anti-ship missiles bolster its threats to United States Navy. Hezbollah got Russian anti-ship missiles via Syria sources, whereas United States it has prepared for its fleets. Group used an anti-ship missile to hit an Israeli ship in 2006. United States taking Hezbollah capabilities seriously. United States official. Powerful Russian anti-ship missiles accurate by Hezbollah give it the means to deliver on its latest valid threats against United States warship and underline the grave risk of any regional war. Sources family with their group's arsenal say Hezbollah leader Sayyid Hassan Nasrallah warned Washington last week his group had something in store for the United States vessels deployed to the region since were erupted last month between the Palestinian group Hamas and Israel, shaking their wider Middle East. The sources in the Lebanon family with the Iran backed group's arsenal say he was referring to Hezbollah's greatly enhanced anti ship missile capabilities. Including the Russian made Yakont missile with a range of 3,000 kilometers. Reports by media and analytics have for years indicated that Hezbollah acquired Yakont missile in Syria after deploying there more than a decade ago to help President Bashar al Assad fight a civil war. Hezbollah has never confirmed possessing the weapon. The Shiite group's media office didn't immediately respond when reached from comment for this story. Washington says it is a Mediterranean naval deployment comprising two aircraft carriers and their supporting ships aims to prevent the conflict from spreading by deterring Iran, which backs groups including Hamas, Hezbollah and Palestinian Islamic Jihad. Hezbollah perceives the United States worship as a direct threat because of their ability to hit the group and its allies. Nasrallah said in a speech on Friday that the United States worship in the Mediterranean don't scare us and will not scare us. We have prepared for the fleets with which you threaten us, he said. The White House said after Nasrallah delivered his Friday speech that Hezbollah must not exploit the Hamas-Israel war and the United States don't want to see the conflict expand into Lebanon.